Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you. And if you're new here, my name is Nadia. Hopefully you'll consider subscribing, liking, commenting, you know. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to make these really, really pretty and fluffy rag rugs. So let's just get straight on to the video. I made each of these rag rugs nine base strings wide. And for this one, I cut five base strings and I cut them from fingertip to elbow and back to fingertip. And obviously you can make it how big you want or how little you want, but I'm just going to make make it nine base strings wide so that it will be pretty quick and easy to do. And I did five base strings. I cut five base strings because on one of them I could just take like half of it and then do the loop and yeah so let's get on to the tutorial part okay so for this bracelet you will need some scissors of course something to hold down the bracelet while you're doing it some base strings for this one I just have this pastel yellow string and it's really pretty but you won't really be seeing it except if you're gonna have them in the ties and the next thing and the final thing you'll need is your scrap thread. So here's my orange and yellow bundle. And yeah, let's just get straight on to making it. Here I just marked out where I want the loop to start and now I'm just gonna make my loop. So here my string got pretty short, so now I'm going to show you how to change it. So you take the string, the base string that you are you were going to do your next knot on, but you didn't yet, and you're going to take another scrap piece of thread, and you're going to lay that scrap piece on top of the string, on top of the base string, and then you're going to do a normal forward knot or backward knot, whichever way you're going. And then you're just going to tighten it, like I did here, and since, since it's just in a, on the string, just sitting there, you're going to pull it up, and that's basically the whole thing. And then after you're done, you can just snip it. and continue making the other ones. So here, I'm going to switch the color once again, and I'm going to choose for my bundle. So here I chose a darker orange string, and I'm going to show you once again how to change the string. So you take the next base string, you take the scrap thread, lay it on top, and do a backward or forward knot, whichever you have to do in the row. just tighten it and then you pull it up and continue on doing that until you finish the bracelet thank you everyone for making it this far if you're still watching and hopefully you consider subscribing liking commenting 
and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye!